be okay. Let's hop right in. Let's talk about August. Uh, adios to this month, uh, which actually wasn't a bad month all in all. July was the cooker. June and July were just so hot. August, it turns out it had seven days in the 90s, but it had a lot of days in the 70s, if you notice. Uh, and a lot of uh, these gray days, too. Uh, several of these, which are spot on where we should be uh, this time of year. So blue was below average, red above average. Our high, uh, the average for the month was 85.5 degrees. And the normal average is 85.8. So we're going to call it an average month. Howard was actually uh, concerned about this because he said he sweated all month long. But again, Howard will sweat if it is over 70 and you notice like the lowest temperature was <laughs> 73 degrees, so that's why. All right, let's get into the temperature trend ahead because I think everybody will be enjoying this after today is very muggy and warm day. It'll be 79 tomorrow, 77 Tuesday, 79 Wednesday. In fact, over the next seven days, I only have one 80 degree day in there. So we are going to go below average temperature wise. What you need to know is today we'll have clouds and a shower, maybe an isolated storm. Tomorrow, 70s, much less humid and sunny. And the week ahead is going to be cooler, dry and sunny until we get to Friday. And then, of course, it's going to rain and rain into the weekend. But it is going to be a nice stretch to start September. Uh, right now, we have clouds across Center City. The Poconos, yes, Lake Wall and Pawpack, you have clouds there. We head down the shore to uh, Ocean City on the boards, and you can actually see a little break in the cloud cover in the distance. And in Bethlehem, Lehigh Valley, you have cloud cover as well. We've seen a few sprinkles making their way through the area. <clears throat> we are now starting to see that pick up. We have a front that's approaching, and we're going to see the shower activity pick up uh, as we head through mid and late morning, so be aware of that. That is the first of two fronts that will cross the area. We have a little break behind this front. We get a little bit of sunshine late today, and then the next front is making its way. You can't really make it out very well, but it's coming out of the upper Midwest and the Great Lakes. Behind that one is the cool and refreshing air. It comes through overnight tonight, bringing us another chance of showers, maybe storms. So here we are, 10, 11 o'clock, some showers, an isolated storm into Lancaster and making its way through the Lehigh Valley and the Poconos toward I-95 by about noon or one and then moving toward the shore and offshore by four o'clock. And you notice we start to get some clearing. So not all of us get a shower or storm. Just be prepared and the clouds will give way to a little bit of sunshine. Seven o'clock, we start to cloud back up. Here comes some uh, scattered showers with that next front that's coming through and that lingers into the wee hours of tomorrow morning before we clear out. Look at that. The sunshine will be glorious tomorrow. Rain chances are non-existent after today all the way until Friday and Saturday. Of course, it would be the weekend. 85 today with a shower here in the city, 79 down the shore and 78 in the Poconos. After this, it is all sunshine 70s and even 60s in the Poconos. So it should be a nice week ahead. And if you like those overnight lows in the 50s, boy, this is going to be your week. Look at all these overnight lows in the 50s. Good sleeping weather. Everything looks great. And if you like rain, if you want your lawn watered, Friday and Saturday, those are your days.